We are on Kritu Perik Aleph Mishnah Gimel, third edition, the first chapter of Masechet Kritu. Now we call it Masechet Kritu, but the Kahati points out that maybe we, he didn't say this, but maybe we should call it Masechet Korbanot, Masechet Chatat, really, because from now until for a while, the Mishnah turns its attention to now that we've listed thirty-six types of Korbanot, we said that if you do most of them Bishogeg, almost all of them Bishogeg, you're Chayav a Korban Chatat. So now the Masechet to explain all the rules of all these korbanot chatat. And the first korban the Mishnah talks about is, is we're going to see the korban of the yoledet, the woman who gives birth. Okay, why? Because she brings a korban, okay, when she, when she finishes her purification days, for a boy, a girl, tavi, she must bring, a ram, a lamb, first year for an ola, she brings birds as a chatat offering. She didn't say she didn't do anything wrong. Why is she bringing a chatat? Interesting question, because I'll talk about it. But nonetheless, so we're going to talk about, first we'll talk about the chata'ot, uh, the korban chata'ot of a woman who doesn't sin. Says the Mishnah, Yesh meviyot korban v'necha. Some women bring a korban, and the korban is eaten, meaning it's a full korban. Yesh meviyot v'eno necha. Some women bring korban, and it's not eaten. Why is it not eaten? Because we're not sure that she's chayeven in the korban. But we allow her to bring a korban, even b'safeh. V'yesh enan meviyot. And some don't bring, a, don't bring a korban at all. So we're going to talk about what kind of, a woman who obviously gives birth brings a korban, but other women also bring a korban, and it's eaten. Okay, these have to bring a korban, and, are, and it's eaten. Okay, if a woman gives, uh, uh, has a miscarriage, she miscarries, obviously if it's a child, if it's a human form, but even if it has the form of an animal, or even a bird, okay, they are yitziro, they are, they are born, they are created. Even if it looks not like a child, obviously in different stages of development, if the, animal, if the fetus was not viable, it would look different. So even if it looks like a behima chayava of, an animal or a bird, Rabbi Meir says she's still chayavet to bring a korban, and it's eaten. Chachamim omim, chachamim say no. It has to have the tzirat adam. It has to have the form of a human being. Hamapel it sandal. If she uh, miscarries a, a fetus and it looks like a sandal, sandal was a shoe. Okay. Oh shilya v'shafir merukam v'ayotze mechutach. We're going to read each one. Shilya. What's a shilya? So we're going to look here. Shilya is right in Wikipedia. It's the placenta, right? It's the birth sac. So Chazal say, let's look at the at the Bartunur for a second. Ain shilya below vlad. There's no placenta without. Even if you can't find it, if you see the placenta, if she had a placenta, then there was a vlad. So that's a real miscarriage. She has to bring a korban. The shafir mirukam. Shafir mirukam. Shafir is like a kind of cylinder. So uh, um, if we look over here, what's a shafir mirukam? You look at Wikimilon. So the word the word has a lot of different interpretations, but. Shafir Mirukam, the Rambam says, according to the Rambam, the Torah, Tchilat Briyato Shel Adam, Gufoka Adasha, as the beginning of the creation of a human form, and it's like the size of an Adasha, a lento. And it, it, there's, like a, there's, like, there's a tiny um, a Shafir can refer to like a cylinder kind of thing that holds this baby. Okay? And obviously she, she miscarried. A child that comes out, Mechutach cuts up, cut up. I guess they had to abort the fetus, and they were in order to save the mother, they had to take it out limb by limb. Tragic. Same is true of a shivcha kena'anit, a maidservant. She is chayevet in mitzvot like an ebed. Okay, she's chayevet in all the mitzvot. You might think, well, since it doesn't apply to an ebed, because he can't miscarry, maybe not. No, shivcha shivila, if a shivcha miscarries, maybe a korban, she also brings a korban, and it is eaten. We'll stop here, dedicate our learning to memory of Tipara Bashmuch Moshe Udvaraleh. Make it a great day.